For many of us, it's a part of the festive season, the look and smell of a real Christmas tree. In northern BC, we are surrounded by trees, so cutting down a tree for Christmas often comes to mind. If you're planning to hunt for your own tree this year, here are some tips to keep in mind before you head out. If your family is planning on trekking into the forest and tracking down the perfect Christmas tree, plan on having a permit or permission before you cut. Cutting a tree down on Crown land needs to have authorization from the province. People can obtain uh, Christmas tree permits either by online, uh, the approvals are available online through the government internet site. Uh, client public can also come down to the Prince George Natural Resource Office on, located on Aspica Drive or they can come down to Front Counter BC here in downtown Prince George and pick up a paper copy of an authorization. The Christmas tree permits are free to all BC residents. And as a word of caution, if you are looking for a tree near a logging road, be aware of truck traffic and the area where you plan to cut. We ask people when they are on Crown land harvesting a Christmas tree that they avoid any known plantations or research areas. And we encourage people to harvest trees immediately adjacent off Forest Service road right-of-ways or hydro right-of-ways. If you prefer avoiding permits and logging trucks, a tree farm can be another option to keep up with the family tradition. Uh, people want to come out here and have an enjoyable experience. They want to walk around. It's beautiful. We have 29 acres all together of, and we have a path going around. It's uh, a lot about just getting out and doing it. Ferry recommends that people have a tree size in mind before leaving home. And then when you get home, recut the tree on the bottom to extend the tree's life. Give it a fresh cut too at the bottom of the tree so it can get as much water as it can in there. Ferry adds that once the tree is in the home, give it plenty of water and avoid placing it near a heat source. Dave Branco, CKPG News.